Welcome back. We've finished the game, but there are some bad endings to look at. Let's see if I can actually get all of them this time. And the first one we're going to look at, actually, we need to start a new game. I wonder if the many ages infinite truths thing is actually referring to the uh, to the differences in the remake. Thank God you've returned. I need your help. There's a great deal of history that you should know, but I'm afraid there's no time to explain. Most of what you'll need to know is in here. Fortunately, no way to skip this in the For reasons remake. you will discover, or any I can't send you to Riven with a way out, but I can give you this. Appears to be a linking book back here to Dunny, but it's actually a one person prison. It's the only way to capture Gen. Here. Once you've freed Catherine, I'll come with a linking book, and she'll know how to signal me. There's a very good chance, if all this goes well, that you'll be returned to the place that you came from. Until we meet again. Take care, my friend. I will agree that yeah, it does not make an awful lot of sense for Atrus to link out here. It kind of takes away the urgency of his having to continue writing in the uh, Riven linking book, which I guess is also why he doesn't say that anymore. I, I get that they wanted you to be able to use the book yourself, especially in VR. That's always nice. Keep expecting to hear borrow. Um... And that they didn't want Atrus just to just awkwardly sit there and stare at you, I guess. But still, it is uh, a bit of a disappointment. It takes away some of the pacing of the introduction as well. Um, not a big thing, at least not to me. One thing I didn't point out uh, originally, because I didn't want to make the pacing of the intro even worse, is this thing on the desk here, which the uh, art book describes as a spectrometer. Presumably, it is one of the things that uh, Atrus is using to measure changes in the age through the distorted linking panel. Also, this locked box that Atrus got from somewhere. Don't really know where. Maybe he had it hidden somewhere in this very, very dark room. Anyway, uh, the reason we're here for the purposes of this video is that um, giving the player control here actually means that, yes, we can look at the satchel. We could even read the journal here if we wanted to. Um, but we also have the uh, prison book with us still. The original game doesn't give you control before it's taken away. This one does. Thus giving us the ability to... Uh, to use it here. Although that does beg the question, is this actually just a normal linking book to Kavir and um, was altered to be a, a prison book? Or does this link to a different place that just looks like Kavir? The latter would be more in line with the prison books don't actually exist explanation um, 
that Rawa has uh, stated and that Mist 4 goes with. Um, and also, you shouldn't be able to link within the same age, so I don't know if changing it to a prison book affects that. But if this was a normal linking book to Kavir, we wouldn't be able to use that because we're already on Earth the same age. Anyway, let's trap ourselves. I don't think I've ever seen uh, Atrus that disappointed since we forgot to bring the donuts. The second opportunity to use the uh, prison book comes right after we get it back in Tay, which I still love. We get to see the inside of now. Just right in front of those guys. I'm sure they. Won't think I'm weird at all. case you are found by the moiety who are unfortunately for us smart enough not to use the book you can also use the book when you return to uh, Riven but it actually makes a difference whether or not you've seen Gen before so to show you what happens when you've not been to Gen I had to uh, load an earlier save and go there first, which I cheated on by already knowing the combination both to get into the site entrance of the linking chamber and the actual animal symbol code as well. Which you can kind of tell by the fact that this drawbridge is still up and the chimney is not closed. I mean, I could have returned those things to their original position, but I didn't. I've never actually been to the village in this particular timeline. Let's see what happens. Sikkim Shokutia. Love you, Matt. Forgive me. Forgive me. I don't believe we've met. I am Gen. And you must be the one whom Atreus sent to trap me. I don't know where you got the brilliant idea to trap yourself. I must tell you that I am quite disappointed that it is you and not Atreus who must now pay the price for this foolishness. Well, this is fine. A 
That's a good question. Is there still time? Because, um... There's no way Aetris would know we'd failed, so... How long would he wait before trying to come through himself? And will Riven last that long? So, what happens if you use the book after visiting Gen? Here we're back to our normal Let's Play sequence of events. And I believe this is the bad ending that I never showed in the original. I see you found the book. Thank you for returning it to me. Yourself, but I must tell you that I am quite disappointed that it is you and not Atrus who must now pay the price for this foolishness. Well, well, well. It starts out the same, but this time again refers to his previous conversation. It's too bad he is smart enough to let Cho try first before using the book himself. Also, that animation was glitching a little bit there, I think. Of course, you can also use the book after you've used it to trap again. Which we still can't tell that we did, but we did. As you can tell by the fact that we're not in the cage. You can do so on the 233rd age. I don't know exactly why you released me. But you realize, of course, that this must be the end for you. It may provide you with some solace, however, to know that with this act of self-sacrifice, you have secured your place in history. The Dani culture will be reborn, and the lives of millions will be purified. Thanks to you. Farewell. Oops. We came so far only to fail right at the end. Maybe not such a good idea. While releasing Gen on Riven has the same effect as releasing him on the 233rd Age, releasing him on Tay does not. It appears that the moiety and I will finally be able to discuss our differences face to face. I don't know exactly why you released me, but you realize, of course, that this must be the end for you. It may provide you with some solace, however, to know that with this act of self-sacrifice, you have secured your place in history. The Dani culture will be reborn and the lives of millions will be purified. Thanks to you. Farewell. Mostly the same, but not entirely the same. The last 
prison book adjacent um, ending is one where we return with the book but refuse to use it repeatedly. I like how he's just right well behind you <laughs> when you do this. I was greatly relieved when I received word that you had recovered the book. I don't quite know how you managed it, but if I may. Thank you. I also really wish the cursor wouldn't show up while talking to him. I mean, the camera's out of tracking, so why does the cursor need to be visible? I don't think Gen ever knew about the prison books at all, so... He would surely not be able to recognize the code. All he at worst be able to tell is that maybe there's something unusual about it. But even then, I question if he knows the art well enough for that. Still, he's smart enough not to just go through. Although, in a way, we kind of have to thank him that he didn't, because... Perhaps it would be best if you went through first. If he had gone through without us, we wouldn't have been able to get out of this cage and would never have found the combination for Catherine. You may need some time to decide. Um. That is reasonable. Please understand, there is nothing I want more than a chance to resolve matters between Atris and myself, especially in light of what has become of Catherine. But unless you are willing to demonstrate to me that your intentions are honorable, I cannot risk it. The sanctuary I've been writing for the Islanders is nearly complete. After all these years, it would be a shame if I were unable to finish it. The work I am doing is quite demanding. Please don't signal me unless you've decided to use the book. Can we follow him? <laughs> I wasn't expecting that this is the glitch, but... Now I have to try. Uh, you left your goggles and your gun there, and then he disappeared. I mean, what were you expecting? Well, this, uh... This is interesting. This isn't supposed to happen. Now... In the original game, you can't free Catherine before trapping Gen because the code to do so is not generated until you've uh, seen it. So, yeah, I turned the ladder transitions off to make this a little faster. So I'm wondering if... Uh, if it, is it the same code? It is the same code. Hmm, might have to try um, that. I don't think I can use the. But we can raise the. or lower, I guess, as the case may be. The cage, so we can still get out. Okay, we're going a little bit off plan here because I kind of want to see what happens if I rescue Catherine and signal Atris at this point. Okay, so it turns out that the code actually just does not work before you trap uh, again. 
So you can't free Catherine prematurely even with this glitch. So I made my way back here, which is definitely a lot more annoying to do than it was in the original game. So let's go back and refuse again. And the cage is down, <laughs> because I did that. I'm relieved you've returned. I thought perhaps you had decided against it. Here, I shall follow you directly. <laughs> Please. Now we get to see him without the cage. That's kind of funny. I'm still not using the book, though. You're free to go. But... I think you should not come back unless you are willing to use the book. Maybe not, but um, you're still not the boss of me. So yeah, gotta go all the way around again. I'll be right back. Okay, made it back. Despite Gen's warnings, let's go back and refuse again. Then, once more. The only path open to you now is through this book. Take it. How about I don't? He's like, why does he even come, keep coming back if he doesn't want to use the book? have changed. There was a time when I might have let you live. I made that mistake with Atrus once. It's a pity you decided not to give me a second chance. Well, there's still time. And we die again. Couple more endings to go. While we are done with the trap book, we still have some bad endings related to the Starfisher, which we can open um, before we get the Catherine's journal. If you are um, lucky enough to guess the combination, or if you just load an old save and uh, get it from there. Um, let me just look at it real quick. 
So combination is uh, six, three. This is my combination, not necessarily the same for your game. Nine. Eight. Yeah, that was the wrong way. Uh, three. Six. One. I think this one's five, and then seven. Which, as you can see, works. Even though there's no way for us to know it yet. That's too low. There we go. Come on, actually raise please. Inside the starfisher now. If you do it this early, Atris just doesn't show up. Don't really know why. We we'll still work as a, as a as a signal for him. But for some reason, he just knows that there's no reason to show up. I guess the stranger still got home, so... Yay us! It's also possible to open the Starfisher after getting the prison book, but before trapping again, so you just have an empty book. Run away. The game won't let me. Using the steam to hide loading the ending is quite clever, I have to say. Atrius is going to be quite disappointed. There isn't much time. Where's Catherine? The trap book is empty. How can you tell? I don't understand. You never did. Father. Father. 
I am no longer your father because you are no longer my son. Um, Cho, did it occur to you that your master just left you behind with no way off of a dying world? I guess not. Objectively, the worst ending, since it's the only one where Atris dies and Gen is set free. Our final bad ending is opening the fissure after trapping Gen, but before freeing Catherine. Gonna say his odds of success before everything really goes to uh, goes to hell. Not that good. Gen is at last defeated, but at what cost? <laughs> the age of Riven is gone, and Catherine. There are no words. And I guess that answers that. He did not succeed. Somehow almost a sadder ending than the other one, although objectively it's not. And that is the final bad ending until someone in the comments will inevitably point out that I missed something. Once again, thanks for watching.